Okay, so which which team is Sugar High on? I know that Blurry's on Germany. Uh, uh, I don't know. Of course, he brought some. Nice but I'm digging the aloe, the tangro, the feral no. thorn. <laughs> Sugar High's team looks like kind of like Auras. It looks like some Patlop shit. Yeah. <laughs> and then he would say it's not so because he has like two offensive mons. Yeah. Okay, so Rain Dash Tender Cruel with the. Gothitelle, I assume, runs either Specs or Scarf. So you can either tr trick some yeah. shit or you can kill stuff with like. Like with the correct coverage move. Like. I don't I don't think the CM reset that's using RS is popular in black white. I think it's usually like three attacks trick. I yeah, this is gonna be a wild run, like be online all the time, catch all the World Cup games is gonna be hard. I, I wanted to focus on the Sun and Moon. A little bit Auras, but yeah, if I'm if I see a black and white game, there's no other game at the same time, I'll catch that too. Yeah, if it's on, why not? I mean, what is this Tangrus even doing? Like, Tangrus doesn't beat this. What? How does he beat this Glisco? He gets Toxics everything, what the fuck? He, he doesn't beat this Glisco He doesn't all. even have heal, but like, this Glisco kind of <clears throat> fucks him up really no, bad. No, Glisco literally 6 hours from pre. Nice who gets this go team Rakion does doesn't Oko Glisco. I guess he's trying to PP stall it between Alamola and Tangros. Yeah. I can see what he's doing. But he's eventually gonna toxic and catch him. Yeah, that's that's a good thing. That won't do anything actually. We should go play by Sugar High because you can infinitely switch yeah, exactly. between them. He's gonna go back. He can't do more than thirty three percent. Yeah, he's regenerator. Toxic doesn't really matter if it only does a little bit of damage at the beginning of the like for two turns, Toxic needs like more turns to rack up. Hmm. Yeah, I thought yeah, you realized that's no point in staying in. He goes Gothitelle. Ooh, what a god. Did he predict that? So he's gonna get the Scarf tricked, I assume. Yep. And he gets pursued. Okay, so Dark Gem is gone. Oh yeah, okay, you obviously outsped him after the scarf oh, got weird. tricked. Oh, weird. I guess he just wanted to lock it into a move. So, it's so is he gonna go Politoed here? Or Ferrothorn get up a hazard? Oh, he can rapid spin. He can rapid spin here. <clears throat> the thing is, is like, Pharaoh does. First off, that's like Mold Breaker drill. Um. How to throw a great matchup, an interactive novel by Blurry. Good lord. Bro, Chat he wrote an article? I love Blurry's articles, it's funny. Now Lavas is going in on this poor guy in the chat. Oh, never mind that. I was about to say it's like... The drill is mold break, I assume. It can only run more. Yeah, uh, Sand Force is Sand Force allowed? I know that Sand Stream uh, Sand Rush is not allowed. Oh, Sand Force is, yeah, you're right. Okay. Is that boy eating young sorry in the bag? Yeah. Dude, I'm I just eating. we're testing this brawl holla game or whatever it's called, I got fucked up because I never played before. Bro, it's so fun though. Yeah, but it's like you can just copy the other YouTubers and do the same thing. I mean, I didn't record it. No, you don't have to record it. It's fun. You play it. Yeah, but if I play it for like five hours or some shit, I don't have any content for that day. No, you only play it for like one or two. Bro, so he's gonna go into Tangros here. Or maybe Alamo Molo. He kind of just loses to Tang Allo. He wanted to um, rain up so he has a rain dish and he's going to spin here. He has to get his hazards up. Otherwise, he's not going to be doing anything. Because Tang Allo just infinitely stalls everything. 
Yeah, but... <clears throat> you see what I'm saying? You I mean, just never... Yeah, yeah, I get it. Drill doesn't spin on that much. You that... see, this, this is way in his favor now that he got his hat. His hat. Especially if he lets the aloe get poisoned. Yeah, yeah. He's gonna maybe go zap those. Um, I go zap. Like he doesn't want to go in the the things that can get poisoned. So he's gonna go Gliscor here, or do these Sangros run HPI sometimes? Sleep out a Giga Drain. So is it like the is it like the Aura set? I have no idea. I've never seen the Tangros in black and white. I think it's like HP fire, or is it ice? I'm not sure. And then, so he's gonna fish for skull I burn think. here, Doesn't and then think. leech seed, and then Giga Drain. Or oh, he's, so he's gonna go into the score here because skull shouldn't do anything. Cause I'm as weak as piss. Okay, so he wants up the hazards, but I wouldn't like I wouldn't risk the fire thorn getting skull burned like. Oh, yes, he has heal bell. Never mind, he has heal bell. Okay. Yeah, hazards are fucking. Never mind then, yeah. So, yeah, that's cool. Because if the. I mean, he can go Excadrill here because he will get the wish, but. Yeah. He can, um. Throw up another spike. I don't know if I would have thrown up another spike on that turn because it was pretty obvious that he would go. And do something to get the wish. And the missile, you see, a bit annoying. But there are no leftovers on the Excadrill, so the Excadrill is gonna get shipped at the lead sheet would be nice. He doesn't zap though, so he's kinda trying to pressure stall the hazard PP. <laughs> no chance he comes out, takes absolutely nothing. Why are you laughing? Are you getting excited because you're the goat at Brawl Hollow? Yeah, I'm gonna fuck you so hard. <laughs> Chill. I'm the goat. Yeah, um, they don't carry. Okay, I don't know if I would have taken Rocky Helm damage on my chance, but he's gonna softball here. They don't carry knockoff because knockoff is like super weak in black and white. And I mean, it's still the utility per but I really, I never really see knockoff in black and white. Because like the base power is like, um, is it like 20 or 30? It's like really low. You can run it on Tang. Yeah, but I don't think he has it. I don't think he want, didn't want to reveal it yet. Has he ran? Has he? It's either Leech Seed or knockoff. I'm pretty sure. So he's gonna go back into Tangles here, I assume. There's no really a point in protecting when he would take Sandstone and Poison. That does more than leftovers can heal. See? Now you're taking... Yeah, the hazards are putting in the work now. Uh-huh. You, you can substitute here, because the Glisco being in doesn't let the Excadrill spin. Yeah. So now he's gonna go back into something to absorb the Toxic. So he lets the Zapdos get... Poison is gonna be in a bad position. Okay, never mind. Nice. Never mind. Okay, so you can protect slash sub here. No, he's he's, he's trying to protect because he doesn't want to take an HP instead of phase. Oh, you can switch. That works. Oh, nice play, catching the chancy. Ooh, but he, he still took the hazard the damage, and like it's not like he can do anything to Gliscor. I mean, Stone Edge maybe would have done a lot. Stone Edge would not have to Yeah, we have to hit kill with the poison heal and the protect and especially with the protect. But the 27, so let me calc real quick if that's banded. Let's load up the calculator here, it's gonna take a few seconds. So this guy let me click on black and white first before we do anything here. I could Let's go or use sub toxic. They carry 40 defense with impish on this in this skull key. I think that makes sense. Choice Bennett CC does 29 to 35. So it's not yeah, bad. Terrakion or your choice garf. But choice garf only does 23, so. Maybe it was like um it was some sort of boosting item. How how fast gliss? How oh, fast gliss score? Mm -hmm. Jolly no defense? Yeah. Scarf close combat is 22 to 26. What is CV? Oh, I remember. It's 27, CV. so. Maybe it's like Fist Blade? 
Is that out in Gen 5? Um, Should be. It could be Expert Belt. I mean, um, Black Belt. Yeah, something like that. I mean, can he just substitute here? He can also go into Chansey, predicting in the double. Into Almomola or something like that and try to get his Chansey healthy. Nah, this is a free sub. Yeah, he can also go into Polito to... I mean, it's a free sub, but it's Klitsko is... Is this... Another, another mm -hmm. cool play, I think, would be... Do you think he can PP stall the Klitsko between Tangrowth and Almomola? Nah, yeah, Not nah, with the Havoc, sure, up. yeah. And if, and if I'm not mistaken, either one or two of I know the tango with this poison is the aloe poison too. Uh, it's poisoned, yeah, but I think it's. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, so they're taking so they're taking thirty six plus six. I think the aloe was cheese spike poison, not toxic poison, if they're, I recall correctly. Yeah, so they're they're taking like thirty six every turn. I don't know thirty plus EQ damage. When they switch in. So they're not. Yeah. That's more than regen. We see 12, 24. Okay, that's. Ooh. 21, yeah. That's, that's way almost too much. dead. No, so now he's gonna go Tangrowth slash Zapdos. I think he could substitute here, yeah. But we'll see how many earthquakes he has. He has 11 earthquakes and 13 subs left. I'm not really the biggest fan of Protect on this set. I know it puts in work sometimes, but I would rather run something else. The hazards are putting in, putting in fucking work. So, you either Earthquake or Protect here. Like, Earthquake, you should predict the Roost. I don't think the Zapdos will stay in, though. I guess he could stay into HP Ice. Oh, did he? What? What? Did he Earthquake? Never mind. He's sub predicting HPIs, that's also a good play. Oh, he's gonna get the hazards out. I mean, if he sacks his Excadrill, yep. the hazards are gonna go back up and this game is over, in my opinion. Yeah. Like, if he just gets them back up later on. But, like, what was his other play? Yeah, he, it's, not that, it's not like he had an option. I'm just saying. I mean, I wouldn't want to play this disgusting team. Okay, so back in the Tango here, I assume. I mean, the team, the team actually looks fun to play. The stall team or the other? So he gets a soft boiled up and uh, no knockoff. Because I think he would have clicked it by now if he had it here. Yeah. Nice play, but he might stone it. She breaking the glitch score, but yeah, okay. If he was fist played as D or something, that would have been a bit dangerous, but a uh, Blurry knows his Gliscor spread, so he can probably figure out the Terragion set. I mean, maybe, I think it could also be like some sort of SD Terragion, but. Or Choice, maybe it's Choice Scarf Adamant Terragion. I'm probably completely wrong here, but I'm just trying to like. throw some ideas into the room, into the area, however you say that. <laughs> So I assume he's gonna see Stone Edge here. Yup. It does absolutely nothing, so yeah, he can go for the crit, but I assume Protect is free here. Because you don't want to risk that, yeah, exactly. So TJ is gonna get up the rocks, I assume. Try to scuff them to rocks. This guy gets a free substitute here. I mean, maybe he's max defense the score and the Turek is banded. I didn't think about that, but I don't think that's the case. I okay, just get the free spike here. Are you recording this? Yeah, yeah. Ah, finally someone who knows. Fucking black fight. I mean, I even... Th game, I think this game could go either way. Even if you don't know black and white, this game is over, like, what? No, this game's over. He loses the hazard. Oh, the drills are... Why am I so behind? What the fuck? Yeah, the drills are dead. It's turn 50. I mean, at the beginning, I thought he had a shot, like... But... 
Because he was like pee pee stalling, but after all the hazards went up. He's gonna go Glisco here in a superpower. Wait, what turn is it? 53. It's 53. Oh, it's gonna works too, because it was a superpower. Just click skip to end. He's gonna go Chansey. Oh, yeah. Because you don't want to risk anything like a discharge. So Chansey has a free soft bow here, like not really that interesting. Ah, uh, doesn't matter. <laughs> so he just goes back into Glow Score because like the Terrakion has to like Stone Edge crit to like break the Glow Score. And if he goes for Glistor Stone Edge and even if he crits, I don't wow. think it would kill. Actually never mind, crits do double the damage so it would kill. But yeah, he can go for Protect here. And afterwards he can go into Ferrothorn. Or also he can go for Earthquake if he, um, yeah, Earthquake is fine too. Like, as, as long as he doesn't get crit, it's fine. Man's just dipped. He's gonna sub here. I would try to protect. I think I would've subbed there. Yeah, this is over. You can't pick less. Yeah, disgusting team, but young team Germany picking up the win, so that's fine with me. Four ETs left. Yeah. I mean, oh sorry, Dip. I thought you left. There's some echo though. Gonna go back to Tangos, get that regenerator. But poison plus sand plus earthquake chip damage plus stealth rock is like makes it so he doesn't really gain anything. The yeah. regenerator is easily cancelled out. With even more damage is done than regenerator can heal. And there's a spike too. Oh, there's a spike? I think I'm behind then. Yeah, it's turn 68. Oh, I'm turn 63. Okay, the switch is out into Ferrothorn, so I assume he's gonna get the spike. No, yeah, I was behind. The teacher has choice locked, so we know, we know all the moves, and superpower is absolutely nothing. It's probably bulky teacher. Yeah, Tita does to spike, the first one gets the free protect here. You can just protect again to see where the Terrakion locks itself into. I mean, I think I think by the way the Terrakion is played, it's some sort of choice. Even though I said it could be like another item at first. Like, he never changed that moves. Yeah, it's probably like, see, uh, Scarf? No, he has... It has to be Adam and Scarf, because like, Jolly Scarf did too little damage, so I'm not sure. Might be Bend or Select. You might be Bend, and I just put the wrong Glisco spread in the cog. Cause like the spread that I put took a different amount. Not sure. Substitute again here on turn 70th. Where I what I'm where I'm at. Okay, 71. Yeah, we got some smoke tours coming in later. I think Sylvan should play today. Where's Kroon? Where's Benge? Yeah. I don't know the time. I assume sometime in the next 5 or 6 hours. But maybe a bit earlier. I mean, it's understandable that he's still trying, but he doesn't really have a win condition. I mean, that turn earlier he went in the Goth Hotel, on the exact turn that he went in the T-Tower. Yeah, that was... I don't know if you predicted that, though. He, he predicted the Goth to trap the Tangrowth. Because if Goth trapped the Tangrowth, he lost. I mean, I get that he would eventually go Goth to tell, but it was crazy that he got the turn exactly correct. So yeah, the Ferrothorn's just gonna get up the last spike here. I'll click Leech Seed. 
don't really see a reason why you wouldn't get the last spike because it even cripples like it cancels out the regenerator even more <laughs> can actually um, check who's in a group who's in a group with blurry Yeah, Padlop is on a young bench for Team Germany, he's not even watching this game for some reason. What a bad cheerleader, Padlop. Bad support. <laughs> oh, nice crit. Not that it matters, he's just gonna protect to get that health. I, he's gonna protect on the Stone Edge, and then he's gonna CC. No, I thought it was... Nah, this is, this is, I mean, he has to crit again. I don't think there's a point in switching here. But if you, if you get crit again, you can't really do much about like double crit. I mean, I mean, know it's um high critical hit ratio, but still. Okay. Oh, okay. So he said we don't wanna. I mean, he didn't wanna risk the first, and it makes sense. Cause now it's only one stone edge left. Gets up the rain, and I assume he's gonna go back into Pharaoh's. Oh, he's protect. Disgusting team, my lord. It's, to <laughs> it's toxic slow. Everything is protect. I've never seen this, um, like, in a life. Like, I've never recorded a game like this in Black War. What do you do if the opponent has a glitch score? Do you shadow tag it with the. the trap it? Uh, yeah, kinda. Does, does it have HPIs on the Goth or something? I don't know. Man just forfeited. I guess it was smart to not risk another Stone Age crit on Pharaoh. Not that it really mattered. Yeah, we will check out the Young World Cup thread real quick. Blurry picking up the win for Team Germany. He's in a group with Funkosaurus, uh, Zordark, Sugar High. So yesterday it was like a ADD Zero game. It took forever. Then Who's record playing? that. Um, I think it was like um, Dice versus. Let me check. Dice versus CZ. Oh yeah, I saw that. But yeah, I'm obviously not gonna record Gen 3 when I don't know shit about it. And the game took like so long. Like, let me see. Did he make a win post yet? Did not make a win post yet, but yeah, Blurry picks up the win for Team Germany and see you guys later with more um, content. Probably the Smog to series between a uh, Bam Gay, aka Crank, and Soul Wind. And yeah, tomorrow Porsche is playing versus Kick Ather. So that's pretty hype. And peace out. Whew, I don't know why I said that so slow. <laughs>